Hello everyone. Recently I read an interesting article in Psychology Today titled, Why Do We Believe in God? In this article, evolutionary psychologist Dr. Satoshi Kanazawa presented his finding using this interesting technique called error management theory. EMT can be used to help answer many questions as to how people think from an evolutionary perspective. In Dr. Kanazawa's opinion, error management theory represents the greatest theoretical achievement in evolutionary psychology in the last several years. So how does error management theory work? It is actually fairly simple. We can divide perceptions into four possibilities. The rows indicate what is inferred by an individual and the columns represent reality. Here Dr. Kanazawa gives an example using EMT to explain why men tend to infer sexual interest from relatively benign interactions with women. Here is a very common occurrence. A man and a woman meet and engage in a friendly conversation. After the conversation, the man is thoroughly convinced that the woman is attracted to him and perhaps even wants to sleep with him, when in actuality the woman is entertaining no such thought. She is just being uh, nice and friendly. Let's use error management theory to help explain why men prematurely th tend to think that women have romantic intentions. Let's look at the four possible scenarios starting with the top left box. In this scenario, the man infers that she is interested, and yes, she is indeed interested. Life is good, and uh, everyone goes home happy. In the second scenario, the man infers that she is not interested, but in reality she is. This is a very costly missed opportunity. This is known as a false negative type 2. And ouch, that has got to hurt. In the third scenario, he infers that she is interested, but in reality she is not. This is a false positive type 1. He gets laughed at, slapped, or rejected. So let me ask you, do you think this is worse than missing that catch? In the fourth and last scenario, he correctly infers that she is not interested. These two go about their separate ways. Evolution should therefore favor an inference system that minimizes not the total number of errors, but their total cost. In this example of is she interested, the yes inferences had more benefits than the no inferences, and men evolved with this behavioral tendency to infer yes. In my next video, we will continue to explore why we believe in God.